Hey boys and girls, we're back to Gotham Budget and today we are making DIY coasters with resin. So I got these coasters as a present a long time ago. And this is what you need. We've got some black paint, your coasters, I got some glue, Mod Podge, all the cells super glue, some resin. This is just the ones I get from Hobby Lobby, super cheap some paper. You're going to need a uh, silicone mat. This is just the small one I had that was clean at the time. And you're probably going to need a bigger one. I also have these paper cups that we're going to use to set the coasters on top so when we pour the resin it just drips down onto the mat. Got your gloves, popsicle sticks, and a measuring cup. Okay, so let's get started with painting the coasters black. I'm just using cheap paint from Walmart. This is just a base coat for the designs later on the paper. So I did a couple coat on these guys. Just make sure it was actually black black. Okay, now that we're done with that, we can go ahead and use the coasters as a template to cut out the shapes onto the paper. And I got this scrapbook paper at a Michael's. It's really cheap. And then we're going to use some Mod Posh. First paint it onto the coaster, place your paper on top, and then use more Mod Posh onto the top part. And this helps sealing the paper when we pour resin on top. And don't be afraid to go heavy handed on the Mod Posh. And while these are drying, we're going to be taking our resin and give them a nice warm bath. Don't forget to put a friend. Quack, quack. So now that the resin is warmed up, this is a two part resin, so one part is going to be half the thing, and then the other resin is going to be the part B. So now I did a cut for each resin so I know that it was going to be covered in the top and the sides. Using your popsicle stick, go ahead and spread out the resin to the edges and using a lighter or a torch. If you're over 18, go ahead. If you're under 18, please have a parent present. <laughs> So with resin, you do have to work fast or it will start to harden. Make sure you cover all the edges and use the lighter to blow out all the bubbles. And last but not least, using that torch and then we're going to set it to dry. spray paint the little coaster rack and back of course so this is just me putting on a cover for these guys because I have cats and I don't want them touching the resin I don't want these falling on them then them being hit with resin so slowly but surely so now that these guys are dry I'm just going to fix the edges a bit. I don't know, they came out really cute. So 
I just used my clippers to take off excess resin that I didn't want onto the coaster. And that's why I said pour more Mosh Posh onto the coasters, help seal them. And that is it. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial slash DIY. I'll see you in the next one. Stay spooky. Wow.